Trini Girl Natural. Hi everyone, <laughs> welcome to my channel. Basically when you want to wash day from heaven and you want your curls to look amazing, this is like the short fire way to get it done. This is like the big secret I guess. It may not be a secret, you may have heard of it. I mean you should have seen it on my channel before, which is using clay or mud to define your curls and cleanse your hair and then just top it up with like your favorite deep conditioner or in my case it's still tied for favorite <laughs> this time I actually used a product that I bought rather than mixing my own clay and it's actually Dead Sea Mineral Mud and not a regular bentonite clay and I don't know if it's the mineral mud or if it's like the other ingredients but this somehow is even more frizz fighting than the bentonite clay it's the J Monique Naturals Dead Sea Mud Hair Wash I reviewed this for you before in another video I think it was in my most bizarre and amazing products but definitely if you're looking for like a really intense cleansing treatment and if you don't really want to make your own um, people use the Terra Essentials but I've never used it and I'm not sure how it works but I can tell you how this works it really cuts down my frizz and it really cleanses my hair it, it does actually contain cocoa betaine as well which is the surfactant for cleansing so the first ingredient is the Dead Sea Mineral Mud which is good but after that it has water and it has cocoa betaine so it's also cleansing it has decoglucoside so definitely gonna get your hair clean and somehow it really kills my frizz as well and after I used the mud wash I just topped it off with one of my favorite deep conditioners the Sotanicals Afrotastic Curl Elastic which I think I've reviewed before but awesome in one word moisture slip definitely top two so yeah enough talking if you just want your curls to look amazing and you just want a little piece of wash day happen and you want a simple fast amazing wash day cleanse with clay and then deep condition and then you're good to go you can just style however you wish so as usual I start off on freshly detangled hair wet so that the clay spreads easier and this is the clay or I should say mud that I'm using from J Monique and <laughs> It was kind of messy, but I started off with scrubbing my scalp, just getting it on my scalp and scrubbing. And then I went through the process of applying it everywhere. I did have a lot of fun with this wash day, I have to say. <laughs> everywhere is a lot for me with the amount of hair that I have, so I sped it up so that you don't have to sit through the whole thing. Again, I don't do it very often, but like every six weeks or so is good. Maybe even every month if you want to. Every six weeks is good for me with how messy it is and everything. So yeah, it really does kind of give your hair a little boost. But I don't overdo it because the pH tends to be a bit high and I like to keep my products pH balanced. Once it's applied everywhere, I just work it in pretty much similarly to how you saw in the last video. So it had a decent amount of slip, but the slip wasn't that great. So as usual with the clay or mud, I'm just slow and careful and working it in. And this is how my hair looks with the clay. I'm smiling because I know it's going to be great once I rinse it out. <laughs> After applying the clay, I cover my hair with a plastic cap for about 20 minutes. And this is how it looks after I remove the cap. So I just do a second little work through. And then I rinse. I make sure to rinse thoroughly to get all of the clay or mud out. I don't want it left in my hair. And you don't want it left in your hair either, so rinse thoroughly. And this is my hair after rinsing out the clay. A lot of my frizz was gone and my curls were really clumped together. Look at that definition. <laughs> Now it's time for my deep conditioner. I'm using one of my favorite deep conditioners, the Afrotastic Curl Elastic from Soltanicals. And again, you've seen me apply deep conditioners before. I just kind of put it everywhere and then work it in. 
pretty much similar to how I did the clay except this is a lot easier because it has a lot more slip. So this is how my hair looks with the deep conditioner after I worked it in. Look how, you know, no tangles, my hands just go through. I let the deep conditioner sit for about 20, 30 minutes and then I rinse it out. And this is it. <laughs> the final result, the moment of truth. My hair was soft, moisturized, defined, popping fluffy like happy <laughs> I was it was good I was in heaven I really was it was my hair just felt so awesome so that's how I did it I hope it was helpful to you and definitely try it sometime if you just want some awesome looking hair awesome feeling hair defined hair okay so that was it I hope you agree with me what did you think Cleanse and frisk back with the clay and then kill it with moisture with the deep conditioner and it's basically wash day heaven. I know I was happy. I was like in heaven afterwards. So let me know if you do this already. Try it out if you don't and just let me know what you think. So this is just one of the wash days in my arsenal I guess. <laughs> Thanks for watching guys and I'll see you in the next one. <laughs> Bye.